Hi, I'm Brandon Sweeney from Ascentium. Today we're going to talk about ESD materials for 3D printing. First off, what is ESD? ESD stands for Electrostatic Discharge. Most of you have experienced an ESD event by walking across carpet, building up a static charge, and creating a spark when you touch a doorknob or other electrically grounded object. Most of the time, a static discharge event like this is harmless. In industry, however, these sparks can be devastating to an electronic device being manufactured. So ESD safe materials are essential. ESD safe materials are also used in areas with potentially explosive atmospheres, including petrochemical processing plants, coal mines, and flour mills in accordance with ATEX directives. According to the National Fire Protection Association, this also applies to areas that handle powder-based 3D printers, since the dust produced from these machines can be an explosion risk. To prevent a buildup of static charge in factory assembly fixtures and electronic packaging materials, either anti-static coatings or conductive fillers are added to materials that must be ESD safe. Normal plastics are electrically insulating, with a surface resistance greater than 10 to the 11th ohms. To be static dissipative, a material must have a surface resistance between 10 to the 11th and 10 to the 4th ohms. If a material has a surface resistance less than 10 to the 4th, it's said to be conductive and starts to have applications in EMI shielding. The standards that regulate the definition of ESD safe materials are found in ANSI S541 and the standard method for measuring conductivity is found in ANSI STM 11.11. .11. Unfortunately, some of the conductive fillers commonly used like carbon black and graphite can have negative impacts on a material's performance. Standard ESD grade filaments tend to be brittle and chalky from the high loading levels of conductive filler, which can easily rub off onto sensitive electronic devices, causing latent failures. Our team at Ascentium has developed a new class of ESD safe materials with our Z line of filaments. We use cutting edge conductive nanomaterials applied right where they're needed on the surface of the filament to maximize the properties and performance of your printed parts. This means you don't have to compromise between ESD safe conductivity and mechanical performance. Our Z line of filaments are non-marring, so they won't rub off on sensitive devices. They're also just as strong and tough as their non-ESD counterparts. Z filaments can be used to print jigs and fixtures for electronic device manufacturing, such as circuit board racks, assembly trays, and component enclosures. Z is great for components that handle powders and pellets, which tend to cling to charged objects. Our filaments can also be used to print industrial equipment located in areas with combustible or explosive atmospheres. So that's an overview of ESD materials offered by Ascentium under the Z brand. If you'd like to learn more about our materials, you can head to ascentium3d.com slash materials.